Welcome back to the Arctic Den. Today we are playing a remake of a game I played a couple months ago called The Smiling Man. Warning, this game contains jump scares, loud noises, blood, violence, and gore. <laughs> if I remember correctly, we have to run away from a guy with a top hat. Well, he had a top hat. He may not have it in this one. And then we had to escape into a convenience store and not leave. I think there's a third ending or a different route. Oh. That looks far more uncanny. Okay. Let's play. Main story, alternate story. I think the alternate story is the old one and this is the new one? I mean, we'll find out. Hopefully I don't have to hold the shift key. Noxus Game Studio presents The Smiling Man. Yes, yes, I know. Yeah, he looks creepy. Please leave me alone, smiling man. I want to go home. And eat candy. I think the game should be starting now after all the credits. I wonder what it's about. Some years ago, I lived in the center of a large city in USA. As I've always been a night person, I often got bored after my roommate, who decided not to be a night person, went to bed. To pass the time, I used to take long walks and spend time thinking. I spent four years like that. I always used to joke with my roommates that even drug dealers in the city were polite. It was a Wednesday, somewhere between one and two in the morning, and I was walking near a police patrol park, quite a ways from my apartment. It was a quiet night, even for a weeknight, and... With very little traffic and almost no one on foot, the park, as it was most nights, was completely empty. So we're in a park? Shift, interact, move, got it. Oh dear. Okay, I think we'll give us the trigger when we can actually run. But yeah, this is definitely different from the other version of the game. I'm probably not going to check it out since that's already on the channel if you go way back. I can't wait to get chased. It's going to be so great. Nothing like a nice walk in the middle of the night. With the demons. I'm sure they can hear you. After a long time of walking, and one bathroom break later, you encounter a strange man, and then you have to run. It's been a long time, I'm tired. Better go home. Oh. Aside from the game being dark in a car. Okay, I, th I think I see what's going on here. As it's, it must be similar to the alternate story. At the end of the street was a silhouette of a man dancing. Or maybe the main story is still the same story. And the alternate one is... Different. I don't like what's happening. This isn't... It was a strange dance. As he danced, he took a step forward. I guess you could say he was dancing. Coming straight towards me. 
Oh no. Those leg movements are unnerving. Hey. Can, can I run? He danced closer still until I could make out his face. His eyes were wide and wild, head tilted slightly back looking up at the sky. His mouth was formed in a painfully wide cartoon of a smile. <laughs> oh no. This is bad. I took my eyes off him to cross the empty street. He stopped dancing and one foot smile perfectly parallel to me, he was facing me. He still looked skyward, smile wide on his lips. Oh no. Sir, please leave me alone. He's gonna start chasing us. Oh no. Wait. He had crossed the street and was crouching slightly. I was so shocked that I just stood there for a while, looking at him. Please tell me it's gonna tell me where I need to go. His crazy run was horrifying. Only he was moving very, very fast. Oh no. Hey, how's it going? What the hell do you want? Anything? You want, uh, some crackers? Just casually goes, aw skips away. I see. He skips off into the darkness, never to be seen again. For like five minutes. Yep. Time to run away again. <laughs> Seems like we're stuck on this, uh, runway though. Definitely more graphically enhanced than the first one. I don't think the story's the same, though. All we can really do is keep running. I ran off until I got on a side road and back onto a well at low traffic road. When I looked around, he was nowhere to be found. Throughout the rest of the way home, I kept looking over my shoulder. I was expecting to see a stupid smile, but he was never there. I lived in that city for six months after that night and never went out for a stroll again. There was something about his face that haunted me. He didn't look drunk. He didn't look high. He looked completely and utterly insane. And that was a very scary thing to see. Oh. So this must be the proper story of the smiling man, not the one where you <laughs> manage to uh, get away via a car. I guess we'll check it out. Blue Tidal. Hmm. This was actually kind of nice. Thank you very much for playing. No problem, no problem. I enjoy playing games. Especially when stuff like this can very much happen to anybody. Play alternate story. I think the alternate story is the old one. 
Yes. One, one night I went to the market to buy something to eat. I do this a few times a week, not only to purchase food, but also to appreciate the nighttime tranquility. And he was there, staring at me, menacingly. Yeah, and this one has objectives. Hopefully it looks different or plays differently. We'll see, though. Seems like the same neighborhood. Got a nice wall. Huh. I said, if it, if this is just the same exact scenario as in same look and everything, we'll, we'll end it off. If it looks different, we'll see if they alter that ending a little bit. But there is only one way to be sure, and that's to experience it ourselves. Although I do think it's a little brighter than the original, which isn't saying much. Quick Mart. Okay, it does look a lot better. It's not on the PSX engine. So I, I guess that actually means something. Hold up. Healthy shopping list. Huh. Hold up. <sighs> what have I done? <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> oh man. Okay, I think it's gonna be a very, very same scenario. But uh, this is this is great. I don't know how to exit this menu or anything. Escape. Nope. Tab. Nope. Nope. Alright, I've achieved it. It's called breaking the game. If you guys have enjoyed today's video, don't forget to hit the like button. Come subscribe. And I will see you in the next one. As always, goodbye.